Hey guys, it's Monica, and today is day 13 of VEDA. Yeah, that's 13 videos in the month of April so far, and I haven't missed one day yet, so that's pretty cool. Anyways, today I thought I would briefly talk about the unrealistic expectations that many new agents have when they enter this business. So yeah, you decided you want to be a real estate agent and um, you heard the market's changing, you heard that it's a really strong market and you know that you can make a ton of money, easy money. And what's so hard? I mean, all you got to do is show a house, right? fist full of dollars is going to come your way. You're going to be a real estate agent. I'll tell you though, the reality is this is not, this is by far a glamorous industry. And this is not a business you can go in to get and make easy money. You can make good money. You have to work really, really hard at it. And unless you have a fistful of contacts, a solid sphere of influence, maybe someone in your life who's a builder who has a subdivision or just a ton of people that you know that are going to use you, it is going to be hard to break in. So before you decide to spend the money and go through pre-licensing and all of that, it's best to have a good solid idea of what it's really like to be a real estate agent because it isn't easy and it may not be suited to your personality. So first and foremost, I think before you jump, investigate, 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 talk to real estate agents, call people up, connect up with them online and ask questions. As a real estate agent, you know, you, oftentimes you work seven days a week and in the summer and the spring and all of that, when there's daylight until seven or eight o'clock, Oftentimes you're working until seven or eight o'clock and you are at the whim of someone else's schedule. So real estate sales, not easy. And your personality may not be suited, nor may your lifestyle be suited for it. And then you're gonna have a budget. Realistically speaking, you should have about six months of sustainable income. You don't know if you're gonna get a closing, have a commission check. It might take you a few months to do that. You need to survive. So a budget is really important. And thirdly, when you enter this business, yes, you're going to align yourself with a broker, but you're going to be an independent contractor most likely. And you are going to basically be in business for yourself. And if you were going to open up your own business anywhere uh, and doing anything, you would never do it without having the funds, without having investigated and really put a plan in place. So that said, I love what I do, and I think it's a great business to be in, but you've got to be self-motivated, you've got to have the plan, and you have to treat it like a business. So if you are really entertaining the idea of entering the business, reach out to me. I will discuss with you and give you the whole scoop, the real inside scoop on what it is like to be a real estate agent. My number, 603-944-9172. No obligation, just call me and I'll give you that scoop. So this is my day 13 of Ada. Thursday is going to be my new agent tip. And next week I'm going to give some more tips on new real estate agents. But right now, this is going to be the biggest tip if you're thinking of entering the business. Don't jump blindly. Give me a call.